Hello guys, I'm Stephen Baker. Welcome to Film Hype. The date is the 5th of November 2010, and let's get to the news because there is a lot of it. It's some pretty sweet news. The new Sucker Punch trailer just got released, and this actually gives you an insight about what it's about instead of just watching hot chicks shoot guns. So please check that trailer out. It is really sweet. The link is at the bottom, and you get to see dragons and girls blowing stuff up because they're women. Ooh. The new Yogi Bear trailer just got released, and if you're a fan of Yogi Bear, then this movie will probably destroy it for you, and if you're not a fan of Yogi Bear, then don't see it because this movie looks awful. So, you know, check out the trailer for that if you want to have a good laugh and be disappointed, because that's exactly what I did. It was just released and in the new Spider-Man reboot, there will be no Mary Jane in it, only Gwen Stacy, so, you know, you're gonna miss out on the beautiful ginger that is Mary Jane. The game Rubik's Cube actually got an agent this week and they're trying to sell it to make it a movie. I don't know what the movie will be about. Is it about an hour and a half of it trying to be solved? But, who knows? I know the only cool thing that has to do with Rubik's Cubes is the scene from Dude, Where's My Car? It's a pretty sweet photos. Jason Siegel is with his Muppets for the new Muppets movie, and it basically shows Jason Siegel sitting there like this, and then all of his Muppets doing some crazy Muppet-esque stuff, so check out those pictures for that. The link's at the bottom. The only good thing about Spy Kids 4 is Jessica Alba's in it, and of course she's wearing a leather jumpsuit, and the pictures just got released, and they are awesome. So please check that out if you get ch a chance. Maybe do it when you're alone. I don't know but it's pretty sweet, so check that out. The movie The Toxic Adventure, which came out in the 80s, is actually getting, or the 70s, something like that. It's a grindhouse film. It's actually gonna maybe get a remake, which is pretty sweet. Uh, me and Vincent sat down and watched it one night. It's actually really disturbing. Uh, it's about this guy who is a total loser and just wants to, you know, be normal, but he can't, and then instead he gets transformed into this hideous monster, and then he goes around killing all these evil people which they deserve to be killed, so you should check out that movie. I know they have it on Hulu if you've never seen it before, but it, it's just a little heads up. It's pretty disturbing. A lot of drugs, a lot of sex, a lot of rape, which is sex, but, you know, just forced. Uh, uh, a lot of, you know, killing and a lot of bloodshed and a lot of retard strong stuff, so check out that movie if you want. It's on Hulu, but the link's at the bottom for the story of the remake. It should be pretty sweet. On Tuesday, I was too sick to ask you a question of the day, and the Friday before, I noticed that I didn't ask you a question of the day. So, today, the question of the day is, uh, because we were talking about Grindhouse movies with the Toxic Avenger, which Grindhouse movie was your favorite? Was it Machete, Death Proof, or Planet Terror? So let me know what you think about that, and I'll have your answer on Tuesday. I wanted to start this new thing also called Shout Out, which is when I give a shout out to the two people that helped me the most this week are actually, uh were my biggest fan and gave me the most input on my show. So this week, it's Corey Newton and Michael Armona because they posted my video on a forum and it actually got it the most views. So last week's video on Friday, not Tuesday because I was sick, but last Friday's video had the most views out of all film hype. So thank you very much, Michael and Corey. You guys are awesome. Yeah, good job. Where are you? My hands are opposite. Good job for you guys. This weekend for Halloween, me and the Friendly Baker Pro guys just kind of wanted to make a movie, so we did, and we made a zombie film, so check out that. It's pretty cool. You know, we did it over a span of one day, and I just edited it, you know? So it's pretty sweet for what it is, and check that out. It's pretty funny and gory, so links to the bottom for that. That's all the time we have for Film Hype today. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Stephen Baker. All the links for the stories are at the bottom in the description. Please subscribe to this video if you're watching it, and follow me on Twitter, and I will check you on the flip side. Bye!